From Maui to Broadway, White Hawaiian is a comedic stage show that covers the career of local boy Eric Gilliam and his Maui upbringing with a unique lifestyle. Here with details, we welcome in the man himself. Everybody, this is Eric Gilliam. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Thank you, thank you, thank you for having me on. I can't, I can't tell you how much I appreciate. Well, this. you know, for I, I said this in commercial break, but we thank you so much for being patient with us. We've had a crazy yeah. past couple of weeks, but I'm so glad that we get to talk story with you about Ooh. your one man show. I have a lot of questions, but the first one is, how did the show come about? Like, where was the inspiration to create a one man show? Okay, so my background is in musical theater, and I. Um, I've been mostly involved in the music industry for the past 20 years. Uh, first as a solo artist with Uncle Willie K okay. and the Barefoot Natives. And then I went on to, uh, to front the band, uh, Mick Fleetwood's House of Rumors Band. So I've been doing music. So now it's been kind of time for me to get back to my musical roots, uh, musical theater roots. And uh, so back in 2019, I hooked up with my longtime creative partner, Brian Cohn, who wrote and directed the movies Get a Job and Kuliana. And then we set out to write a dynamic show uh, that revisits my family's stranger than fiction entertainment history in Hawaii. <laughs> I love yeah. that. And we're looking at some footage right now um, on our screens. Everybody looks like they're having so much fun. And if you guys didn't know, Eric's sister is one of our good friends of the show, Amy Hanayali E. Now, I got to ask you, does she make an appearance in your show? Uh, she does. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> so... <laughs> it's pretty much everybody does. So my great-grandfather was a bare-fisted boxer uh, from Vancouver. And in 1902, he was shanghaied on a boat from the Barbary Coast. And he, he ended up in Kahului Harbor where he met my great-grandmother uh, from Molokai. And then they had a daughter. They got married, okay. had a daughter. Uh, and my grandmother, our grandmother, Jenny Napua Wood, uh, she started doing the Kodak Hula show in Waikiki. And then she ended up in New York performing with Billie Holiday and on Broadway. Oh. And she went on to appear in over 200 50 films and TV shows. And then she had a son, our father, uh, who grew up on the mainland and in Hollywood around, you know, a lot of famous people uh, before meeting our mother. Uh, and then my brother, Timmy, is one of the captains of Hokulea. And of course, my sister, Amy, is a highly successful <laughs> entertainer here. And uh, all of them appear in the show. Okay, good to know. And I hope it comes with a, a family tree chart because that was a lot to follow along. It, it really is. <laughs> it really does. It, it, it starts in 1902 and you kind of meet all the people until you get to me. That is so crazy. So I got to ask you, do you impersonate all of them? I do. Oh, okay. Uh, so, yeah, so, uh, yes, I do. And, 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 and many others, but... Um, the show covers over 100 years of our family history through comedy, storytelling, and song, and dance. And yeah. then there's a bunch of video uh, segments that showcase Hawaii's, our own rich history uh, following the overthrow of the monarchy. But um, we started performing the show prior to the pandemic in 2019, and now the show plays weekly on Kauai and Maui for both residents and visitors. There you go. Uh, and the response has been overwhelming. Um, I think the reason audiences from all walks of life get really excited about the show is yeah. that... They can see themselves. I mean, their their own family in this sort of universal stories. It's about love and loss, success and a heartbreak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See something relatable to everybody. Now I'm gonna ask you, what are some of the challenges of performing by yourself? Because when I co-host, you know, I have John and Kelly to bounce off of, but you're just up there by yourself. But I and I know you were telling me that you kind of juggle a lot of hats. You know, you wear a lot of hats, you juggle a lot of things. Yeah, I've got 36 costume changes, and my longest costume wow. change is only is is 30 seconds. So wow. I do this, and it's it's sort of a magic show that's going on backstage, and it is all on me for sure. Mm -hmm. But once the curtain opens up, it's 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 uh it's been a real team effort, you know, with um to bring it to audiences. But our video editor, uh, Eddie Adi El Ad, has done an amazing job, and he was the first editor on the TV show, The Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Yeah, <laughs> nice. And then, yeah, and then there's Lynn McEwen at Pro Arts and Ben Karen over at the Porter Pavilion in Kauai has done an incredible job. They've been so, so supportive uh, to get the show out there. And I, I do still perform uh, as a solo artist and, a, and in a duo with uh, with Vince Esquire from Connie Koa. And I still get to play with Mick Fleetwood, even though we've lost the venue in Lahaina, sadly, but we're, we're working on some other things. And uh, 
Yeah, so I get I still get to perform with a lot of superstars, but now this this one's for me, White Hawaiian. You know, um, I hope that we can continue to do the show as, as long as my body can take it and possibly <laughs> take it on tour to the mainland and at some point, you know, um it does take a lot of energy to put the show on uh, with all of the, you know, sort of fast paced singing and dancing, but I love it all. And I am so, so happy to be doing musical theater again. I love it real quick. And then I know that you said that you're on Maui and Kauai, but will we be able to get to see you on Oahu? Well, okay. So we are so excited to bring the show to Oahu someday. You know, um, I've been searching for the right venue in Honolulu or Waikiki, or at least, you know, to perform monthly, if not weekly. Uh, and it would bring the, it would actually bring the show full circle to where my grandmother Napua really first got her start. So hopefully we can find the right theatrical partner over there as we, you know, as we have on Maui at Pro Arts and here in Kihei and Kauai and Kilauea at Porter, Ville, Porter Pavilion. I'm, now, I'm sure audiences here will love the show as much as, as everywhere else. And because at the end of the day, you know, White Hawaiian is 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 so much fun to perform. Mm -hmm. um, everybody could use a little laughter and joy in their lives, Very especially true. right now, especially on Maui. Very yeah. true. You guys, you guys can learn more information at whitehawaiian.com. But as always, head over to kjun2.com. We're going to have more information, including how you can get tickets to support our boy, Eric Gilliam. Good All to right. see you, brother. Can't wait to see you Thank in person you. soon. Aloha. Have Aloha. a great day. Aloha.